Yo, what's good, YouTube? It's Chrome here, back in the video for you guys. Today, today we're going over uh, the best settings in Apex Legends for a console, man. Not console, but uh, controller. My bad. My apologies. I play on PC. <laughs> but, um, yeah, man, this is the best uh, settings that I could, I find, personally. And I love it, man. Like, you can beam like this, dude. Beam. I need to go down a little bit, down to the crotch area. You know, everyone likes down below the belt. <laughs> uh, but, uh, yeah, man, this is uh, a really good... Uh, settings man i hope you guys give this a go man because this is probably the best settings in the game for controller because you know we play controller i know if i play a controller i'm on pc well i'm not a keyboard mouse person man i'm a controller guy okay i'm a roller gang baby you know <laughs> but before we get into the video man be sure to leave a like and subscribe man we're trying to hit 2k followers bro and that would mean the world to me man and if you guys want to play with me or, or watch me live uh, we do stream on uh, Twitch almost every single day. Uh, eventually, we'll start streaming on TikTok. So be sure to follow my TikTok. We upload content on there a lot, and I really appreciate it. And be sure to follow my Twitter and Instagram. Uh, we're on Twitter almost religiously. So be sure to come by to follow me. I really appreciate it. I love you guys very much. And the links are down in the description. But now, let's get right into this setup, all right? So far, this is my settings, man. Right here, controller, baby, all right? Mm -hmm. oh, let's go to gameplay, man. Uh, you guys know that... A lot of big players, like big streamers, stuff like that, they have all their shit turned off. Wait a minute. This isn't the right one. That's gameplay. But, like, these are my settings, man. 106 FOV, man. Uh, FOV scaling, that would help your aim if you're Bloodhound or uh, Octane. So I turned it, I disabled it because it, like, makes your, makes the 106 turn to, like, an 80 or some shit. Uh, something like that. Something like that. Not that much, but it it, it does lower it a bit. Uh, but these are my settings, man. Um, everything is on low or disabled. Uh, I probably could put this one down a little bit more, but um, I don't feel like moving that down below. So, yeah, and I'm not sure what the fuck these are right here, to be honest with you, but we're leaving the hell it is. <laughs> so, but yeah, man, this is what I use for that. Audio, I have everything turned down and everything like that. Uh, but now let's get right into the controller, man. That's what you guys are here for. Uh, the button layout. Um, this is it. I play on a scuff, so I use back paddles. Okay, my right one right here. Um, is my crouch. Uh, this one right here is in my melee. Um, this is my... I meant... This is my triangle, the inner one right here. Right, crouch right here. Switch. Uh, this one right here is my punch. And this one here is my reload, the inner one on my left side. My reload. But I don't use the two inner paddles, to be honest with you guys. I really don't. I really don't. I just, I don't, I don't feel like it. So, yeah. They're there for there, but, yeah. Um, but now, uh, I do play stick and move, basically, too. So, my R3 is my jump. Which you guys see in my streams and my videos and stuff. I do panic jump a lot. Just a bad habit. Uh, I wish I could turn this to crouch, but it fucks my gameplay too much. I don't want to relearn using this as jump. I mean crouch instead of you know so we just do, 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 do. Like this, you know? yeah um but now let's get right into the everything else man uh have to use man default basically but basically sick and uh sick and move because i just customize this right here so yeah i do play uh flipped you know it it, it the response time to shoot is a lot faster than triggers and my recoil control is a lot better playing flipped, okay, guys? A lot of people have this issue. Uh, it is a lot better shooting and aiming with bumpers to control your recoil. It really, really is. Uh, for my sensitivity, I play on 4-4 Classic, okay? 4-4 Classic. I used to play uh, Fine Aim, which Fine Aim was honestly really, really good for me. Um, I really enjoyed Fine Aim. Uh, it was really good for my, my, my R99 up close and everything. I was like, do, 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 like that, man. I was straight up, you know, missing, not missing a bullet, you know. Uh, I really fucked with fine name a lot, you know. Do, 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 not missing a shot, you know. And, uh, then I eventually switched it to, um, uh, steady. Because the problem was fine name, though. Like, for example, let's use this, for example, this site. A uh, fine name. Uh, using this, I could not use this site how I do now. I mean, it's still a little eh right now with Classic because uh, I'm not familiar with the recoil at this far. And there's a lot of recoil at this point. But I can control it quite a bit, you know. Um, 
But like Fi name, it would be like it Fi name would be like this. It was like it was it was terrible for long range. And it was it's awful. But now it's a lot better because I went to Steady next. I tried Steady, man. And Steady was actually pretty good, man. I usually used it quite a bit. Dropped almost a 20 bomb with it. And it was pretty nice. I was, I was messing with it a lot. And um, it's honestly really, really good. The only problem, the only reason I switched from Steady to uh, to Classic was because it, had, it was a little bit better long range for my 301 in this uh, 3 pack site. That's basically, that's almost like the only reason I really did it, to be honest with everyone. Um, also, there's a lot of big streamers and top Apex Predators and stuff like that and players that uh, play on Classic. So, I used it and I wanted to get better with it. And what do I know, man? I dropped two 4K bombs and, or no, three 4K bombs and a 20 bomb with it. So, I mean, it's... This is this class streak. This takes practice, you know. Warm up your aim, shoot bots as much as possible. Firing ranges is your best friend. Learn the recoil patterns for each and every single gun. You know you want it on the texture pack so you can see where the recoil goes, which I don't have the uh, the things up there because you know uh, bad graphics and stuff. You know, not bad graphics, but it, it requires more, and I don't want more. You know, because of my my, my PC is kind of like you know not that good. You know, so I don't want the overheat it or shit you know so there's that man um what else do we got here a dead zone is sm my, yeah my dead zone is small a uh, movement dead zone is small everything uh vibration is off you play vibration on you're fucking weird i don't make the rules guys i'm sorry <laughs> uh but that's about it man a uh, mouse and keyboard uh I, I, don't, I don't even mess with these to be honest with you man so i'm not gonna get into it um but yeah man that's, that's like the best uh things you can get man uh in my personal opinion and uh, yeah, it's just it just feels so much better. Like you can just beam, 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 baby. You know. So, if you guys enjoyed this video, man, be sure to leave a like and subscribe. Man, I really appreciate it. And be sure to go down to my description and follow my Twitch, Twitter, Instagram, and TikTok. I would greatly appreciate it, man. I would really, really, really appreciate it. I love you guys very much. I'll see you guys in my next video. Peace out.